after the windows been made we then um, go back to the create panel object and compound objects okay let's do a boolean operation to remove that to create a door okay so that's your door now notice that your your building becomes empty okay so what we want to do now is to use another modifier okay called a shell okay that makes that solid okay as solid as you like it right and then let's move the door in Okay, so that's the door. Well, um, we can later put some textures on the door, but for now, let's create the other parts, okay? The fan, for example. So again, let's go back to the shape, line tool, and I'm gonna just create view isn't it and mirror that in the y direction okay mirror that line move that down select both and let's do something else okay we can do the same thing um, attach the two lines together select that the vertices and weld that um, maybe higher value okay so let's weld it now 0 0.1 and what we can do here is to connect two vertices together. That makes that one single shape and we can name that the, the blade. Right? So let's go back to perspective view and apply an extrude. Okay? So that's your your fan blade. It's a little bit too wide so I'm gonna scale it slightly and apply an edit poly to it and you will know why I want to do this in a short while okay what I'm gonna do is to make a few quick slides click okay make a few quick slides of this part Let's do it the other way. Slice plane. Slice, uh, wait.
slice. Slice loop. Okay. Slice and slice. And that's it. Okay. Um, the reason I wanted to do that was so that I can add a, a twist modifier to it. Y direction. Okay, slightly twisted. Okay, just slightly twisted. And let's go back. Uh, Add another edit poly to it. Select these three parts. Extrude. Okay, so that's that's our, our fan. So we're gonna create this the center of the fan of the blade with a cylinder again. Reduce the height segment and put an edit poly to it. From the from the sub object, and now we're gonna put this up there. Okay. Well, the way to rotate that so that you know you have a, a few copies is to change the pipe pivot point okay so that it's right there at at the edge of the the handle okay switch that off so now the pivot point is there and you know when we rotate okay that will happen okay control z now let's go back to go to, to edit no sorry tools array and we're going to rotate that in three directions. So that should be what? The direction should be a Y, yeah? So we're going to have three blades at the Y rotation. Okay, so 360 divided by 3 is what? 120. Okay, preview. And we have it there. Okay, select the three and move them to the center sorry further out okay and let's move them further out so that it doesn't touch the roof and what we can do is, um, we're going to extrude that again. Okay. Um, 
that should be an edit editable poly and let's join multiple okay so let's attach okay oh that was a that was a copy so make it unique that's why we cannot join them together now we can join them attach that that okay so that becomes um, your blades okay the thing with that is because um, the center point is not not exact so let's remove it first okay we, we can do that later now after we've created that the next step is to apply some textures to it okay with start starting with the door 